Student Caucus Update. On the agenda for the April 12th meeting were fire drill procedures and the student satisfaction data from the recently released survey. While many students were confused and concerned about how public safety handles search procedures, Senior Gordon Jones clarified what they are able to do. Searching without touching, that anything that is in view, if it's sort of discreetly behind something, but you could walk and you could see it, or if it's up on top of your bed, or if it's under your bed, that if they can see it, then, then that's fair game. Sophomore Michael Carter turned the discussion over to Dean of Students, Deb Myers, inquiring about what she thought the appropriate procedures should be. There's like a lot of, of rumors going on about what's happened, but I think if there's any student who really has had their stuff, you know, their privacy violated, I'm happy to hear that from you. I know Jonathan is happy to hear that from you. That's what they're going to do, they just need to make that clear, because it seems like all the issues are that the expectations are not clear for anyone. If they're searching for fire code violations and you know handbook violations, and if, you know if they find something, they're going to look for more. If that's the case, and maybe it will be the case, and maybe that's okay. But I think that that needs to be clear. Later in caucus, the results from the student satisfaction inventory were presented. The results were accumulated in the past two weeks with about 250 responses to the survey. This inventory was conducted, in most part, to attain a better understanding of student satisfaction, especially in regards to the college's low retention rate. When I look at all the good things going on, I think, why not more finishing? And so we hope that through the data, through some of the other data that you the, the surveys that you finished, we're kind of compiling those all together to say, so what aligns, what matches, what makes sense? According to Jim Hundreiser, who presented his company's survey results to caucus, Warren Wilson students expect a lot from their institution. Yeah, yeah I've done this with like 50 schools. You, you are some of your levels of expectation are the highest I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> <Never. Never. laughs> Among the inventory's significant findings includes evidence of some dissatisfaction when it comes to academics. We see a lower satisfaction compared to other students at other private institutions. So it is certainly something that you want us to focus on. So while I just talked about several negative things, in the end, you're really pretty satisfied. Um, you're overall, you're pretty satisfied. 30% uh, of, of you said it's about what you expected. 33% of you said it's better than you expected. So that's what we would hope to hear, that we're in that. 